with an easy question. First, spell your first and last name for me. Annette, A-N-N-E-T-T-E, -T -T -E, Elbaum, right. E-L-B-A-U-M as in Mary. Yeah, okay. I know a Michael Elbaum, but he spells it differently. Anyway, he's a skin cancer guy. Okay. Um, <laughs> so now, Annette, tell me how old you are. 69. How old are you really? 69. Really? <laughs> I really am. Yes, I am. You look fabulous. Thank you. <laughs> tell me how you got to look so great? Well, I always uh, was aware of my appearance, and uh, I uh, was directed to Dr. G. M. Papa, and I met him approximately 10 years ago. Mm -hmm. So what have you, tell me what you've had done over the 10 years. I've had a surgical procedure previously, way, you know, approximately the 10 years ago, I would say 10, nine years ago. And uh, then, of course, I would come into the office and kind of visit, and everybody here had been wonderful, very mm -hmm. friendly. And um, I didn't want any procedures anymore that I had to have any kind of anesthesia. You know, I, I always felt that anesthesia was a dangerous thing to have, mm -hmm. being in the medical profession. Mm -hmm. And uh, Dr. G and Papa had mentioned the stem cell procedure facelift, and would I be interested in it? I said, if I don't have to have any anesthesia, and he said, no, absolutely not. You don't have any anesthesia. You can have a local with that. Mm -hmm. I said, that sounds wonderful. And so, of course, you know, we went through the procedure, which was wonderful. I was up the whole time. Uh, I didn't feel any pain. And uh, after the procedure, it took approximately a week, you know, to heal. And I know after that, when I would go into uh, shops and I went to purchase some ma makeup, I remember the fact that women would say, the cosmeticians behind the counters would say, your skin is beautiful. And I looked and I said, yeah, I, 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 yes, it is. <laughs> you know, and I, it's something that I never had. I did not have beautiful skin when I was a teenager. Mm -hmm. That I did not have. Now, you had the stem cell facelift how long ago? Two years ago. Mm -hmm. It was two years ago, yes. Describe for me the difference that it's made. The difference that I feel good about myself. I, I, I just feel good about myself. I, I feel, I don't feel 69, let's put it that way. And uh, that, that's what it is. It, it just makes me feel really good about myself. Now, okay, but separate from the way it makes you feel, how do you describe the difference you can see it, that it's made in your, your face, your skin, and so forth? I don't look very different than I did previously to this. There's just something a little different. Uh, I don't have any kind of marks generally in my face that was left over from, uh, you know, acne as a teenager, and that made a big difference to me, and uh, it was hard to believe that that was not basically there anymore. Mm -hmm. And of course, my, my cheeks uh, were enhanced as to what they were a number of years ago, but very slightly, so that people that would meet me again say, gee, they would say to me, you look terrific. I mean, you haven't changed at all. And I say, well, okay. <laughs> but, but I can see that your rosy cheek, the skin quality, mm -hmm. how would you describe sort of and what, what the, like you said, you, the cosmeticians were uh, commented on it, but what have you noticed about your skin? Uh, it's, it's soft, but it's, you know, but it's firm. It, it's, it's nice, it's firm, it doesn't bother me at all. Uh, it's just comfortable to put light makeup on. Uh, that's basically, you know, what I'm dealing with. I don't feel that I need any, you know, the Botox and the fillers at this point because it, this has done the job so far. Mm -hmm. Happy with the result? Oh, definitely. Definitely. Okay, you need to tell me that, though, rather than, so uh, what do you think about the result? Oh, I'm very happy with the result, <laughs> as you could tell. No, I really am truly happy with the results and the fact also that it was not, you know, under anesthesia. It was something that could be done and could help me to continue to look the best that I 
can and keep working and keep so now, useful. what would you say that your outside matches the way the inside feels? Yes, it, it makes me feel good about myself.